Hi, this is Nilanjan Ghosh from Informatica Global Customer Support and today we are going to demonstrate of how to migrate repository service from a lower environment to a higher environment. So Informatica does not allow to migrate repository service by taking a backup from a lower environment and directly restore it into a higher major version of power center. So today's agenda would be to take a backup of the repository service from the lower environment, create a new repository service in the old domain which belongs to the lower environment with a new name, restore the backup in the new repository service created under the domain and then disable it. After that we will be creating a repository service in the new domain with the same name and in the same location and then we would upgrade the repository service contents so let's see how we can do that so we have a repository service this is a 951hf3 environment called neil repo so we will take a backup of this repository service we will give it a name and if there are any existing files it will replace it so the repository service contents are being backed up okay now we'll go ahead and create a new repository service with a new name so say we okay and we will give the license information we will create a new repository service and then finish and this is disabled and enabled the repository service this repository service does not have any content so we will back it up we'll restore it from the backup file which we created so this is the backup file so so the repository service is getting restored with the contents of Neil repo which we took a backup from So, so the restore service contents is in progress so we'll wait till the service contents are being restored in the newly created repository service under the domain which belongs to the lower version of Informatica so now we have we'll look at the new environment this is a 961 environment which we have so we'll just log out we'll log back in. it's a 961 environment and this has been restored successfully what we can see and uh, we will have it normal mode okay so once it is so it will enable itself so let it enable in the new domain we'll create the exact repository service at that same location so it will be um, neil repo one neil underscore repo underscore one and um, it is the primary node where it is assigned to it's the oracle database and the username will be either, and the password will be the same so Rob 11 G2 and uh, let me see okay so it's available presently 
and uh, we'll go ahead and disable the service. Once we disable, I'll show you this is this belongs to a 951 environment. Once let it get disabled, disabling it says um, so. Okay, now it's disabled. I'll just log out and show that it's a 951. It's a 951 hotfix 3 environment. So presently, the newly created repository service is disabled. This is the one from where we took the backup, and this is disabled presently. So we have, we are about to create the same repository service name at the same location, and we'll click finish. And uh, this is disabled. We'll enable it. It's available, but it gives us a message says the repository version 182 is incompatible with version 184 of the product the repository version is 91 of the product uses 93 and upgrade may be required so what we'll go we'll do is we'll go to contents and do an upgrade we'll give the username password click OK and it will start upgrading. So this is a 961 environment where we are we have pointed it to the same location with the same username password and we are upgrading the contents of the repository service. So it says upgrading service contents in progress. So what happens is generally the table structure changes across uh, major versions and we have to upgrade the metadata contents. So this is available. We'll change it to normal mode. Click OK. Mm. So it's enabling the service presently. So fetching service status in progress. And now the repository service is up and running in 961 environment ready to be used. So this is how we migrate a repository service from a lower power center environment to a higher environment. And uh, you cannot take a backup and restore directly into a higher environment oh, okay. so okay. so you can refer to KB article 323854 which is related to this um, KB we would love to hear from you and you can email at support videos at informatica.com Thank you for watching this video.